Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Hello everybody, welcome to the analysis of the Forex markets from the ForexPSIMI.com. Let's continue to discuss the situation on the euro currency. Well, in general we could say that during the previous couple of weeks market just stand in the tight range. Some kind, this was previously flag, this was the upward failure breakout, now it's turned to the downside, returns back again. So we can see that market is flirting with this line, the pivot point for the current week and stands in, same, stands in the same area. It's very tight consolidation. When the market is calling around some area and stands in the tight range, it usually causes the market building an energy, and very often it leads to the breakout in one or other direction. And usually this breakout could be really significant. So you can see, for instance, right here, some kind of the consolidation at the tight range, and thrusting out the upside fast acceleration, so in some direction. So that could be something like that. Yesterday we said that market is forming side by side two bearish patterns and the failure of these patterns is the move above this the high of this bar and above weekly period resistance 1 it's around 131.85 area something like here. So uh, this pattern hasn't failed yet but by yesterday's close market has shifted daily trend to the bullish side. So you can see by the MACD indicator that close was above the MACD line and uh, formally, theoretically, current trend on the daily time frame is bullish. But still this fact is not quite erase the possibility of the downward downward move. Because market now hasn't shown any thrusting move to the upside. It's just stand tight range and on the daily time frame I at least currently do not intend to uh, doubt the possibility of downward uh, continuation. So to shift my expectation I need some more signs of the mm, bullish uh, sentiment on the market and because as you can see uh, the standing in the tight range right at the lower border of the triangle is a bit worry sign because take a look how the, that developed touch acceleration to the upward border touch acceleration to the upper border. But here we do not see the thrusting move, the jump from the lower border as the common for consolidation for the bullish price action. Well, that's a bit worse sign when the market stands and calling around the lower border of some pattern. And that's why I mm, do not want to deny the possibility of the downward move. Also by the fact that this pattern that we have discussed yesterday hasn't, hasn't failed yet and it's, it's, it's still valid and market still could continue to move to the downside. On the 4 hour time frame we see the same better fly that we have discussed previously and the second moment is that this better fly hasn't failed yet as well because to erase this better fly market should move above the swing high above that dash black line that is the top of that initial swing of the better fly if market will do this and move to the upside, in this case we could say that probably this butterfly will not realize. But at least currently it still has chances to work. Although you can see that the 4 hour time frame is bullish also. On the hourly time frame this is another possibility for the butterfly. I have drawn this one but also you could find another butterfly for instance here. Some kind of the it's a bit skewed butterfly it also could be treated as the Butterfly that is the left wing, right wing and further potential acceleration to the upside. But this price action is really anemic so uh, it's not very impressive. That's why uh, it's overall chap and sloppy consolidation around the weekly pivot point makes me think that uh, market is still could show uh, the downward move at least until the butterfly hasn't, been, hasn't cancelled. So in general uh, I think that today trading session will be the session of expectation. So if you have short position, market hasn't 
uh, reached the level that could uh, give you the confirmation of its failure because market hasn't erased as better fly as tab grabber on the daily time frame and I suppose that if you have bearish position it's better to hold it well if you're bullish well in this case probably it's better to wait for the failure of the bearish patterns and some kind of the acceleration to the upside that markets really start move to the upside before entering on the long side of the market that's why probably uh, if you have no position today it's better to sit on the hands and watch for the further development maybe it will come on the uh, next week